started to work on the hard lines I bought some Bundy tube which is just a steel zinc coated 3 16 line also got the 5 16 for the fuel supply and then a friend put me onto this um, Kunifa which is a, it's a Cupro nickel copper 90% and 10% nickel it's, um, they use it mostly in European countries and, and I guess in the States as well I'm not too sure about that however it's um, much softer and being copper and not coated it will not corrode so I think there's a some good benefits there and also the fact that it's kind of gold coloured it matches the original lines so I bent some uh, after a false start making a <laughs> mistake uh, these ones look pretty good and I've got the insert nuts which are CAD plated look quite good well it's not cadmium it's yellow passivate isn't it but um, quite pleased with them and I thought I'd give the steel a go as well looks a bit off with that but anyway it is a lot sturdier obviously it's a lot stronger and would retain its shape not over short distances like this but the longer lengths and I'll show you what I mean so I haven't exactly straightened this but I've just rolled it out by hand and you can see it just buckles under its own weight it, the, the long pieces that, from the front to the back of the car like these ones you know this one just just remains straight the steel you know it doesn't buckle at all it's and I've heard of the work hardening that, that can go on with these you know all the vibrations over time can work hard on it so you might have to add supports I mean I think that's and being a small car it's got you know there's one and there's another and there's another and there's another they're so close to each other I don't think it will be an issue for vibration but you know when I started working on it I just thought there's no way I'm going to be able to keep this straight over that whole length it's um that and also the fact um, I'm in Australia and I just found out that copper is illegal to use I guess either we haven't caught up with the world or we know something that <laughs> the rest of the world doesn't but you know it's such a fantastic little product that doesn't corrode and and would you know retain I guess not exactly this color but it will retain a nice gold color uh, which again as I mentioned will match OEM seems uh, like a shame my only other option is to well get this tubing uh, cleaned up and and replated with yellow cad um, I have to think about that one 